I don't plan to interfere with your job. If you have to prosecute Jason, I, I mean, I guess I'll, st I'll stay out of it, but I seriously don't see that happening. Why not? I'm sorry. Look, I, I think that you are probably a, a, a brilliant DA and, and wonderful. I just don't, I don't ever see Jason getting caught. Do you think that Jason shouldn't have to pay for the things that he does? That he shouldn't have to pay the debt to society? I just, I think that there are a lot worse out there. And those are the people that you should be going after. Look, if you want to know if I want Jason to pay for what he did to me, I want Jason to miss me until it hurts. I want him to feel everything that I feel right now. But I, I don't need you to make that happen for me. I'll... I'll deal with that on my own. You know what I want? I want you to just stop hurting. That's sweet of you. I, you and I, are, we're, we're still trying to find our way, and we don't need to deal with that right now. And I, I just want to let you know that I'm not going to bring any of that, Jason and, and my business, into this house or into our family. Okay? I'm sorry I haven't been around, Sonny. Alexis needed me. I'm sure you already heard about what happened. How you feeling? I feel better. I slept. I'm just hungry. I'm gonna okay. eat. How about Milo? Fix you something? Well, Milo's a vegetarian, and whatever he makes is not worth eating. But I'll get him anyway, because just in case I fall and cut myself. You, Jason. Good enough, Rick. Oh, good. We had some substantial injuries there. Pretty major surgery. I'm not really sure you should have left the hospital. I'll manage. Well, you really should take care of yourself. You don't have to worry about what's going on here. I'll watch, Sonny. No, you won't. It's a new day, Jason. See, while you were otherwise occupied, my brother and I reached an understanding. That's finished now. Here's a headline. You're pretty much responsible for Sonny's current state of mind, so your presence here is not something that I really think we should celebrate. You're not needed anymore. It's not your decision. See, while you were you were busy with Manny, and rightly so with Sam, I took care of Sonny. Yeah, now you can leave. Because you know what's right for Sonny, huh? You know what's good for him. You betrayed a man that you called your best friend. You stole his business, you, you stole his life from him, and then you walked away. I'm not really sure why you are here, Jason. What's your agenda? What'd you forget to steal from him the first time that you want to try to get this time around? Because I don't believe for one second that you got my brother's believe best interest what you, in heart. Believe what you want. Just believe it somewhere else. Okay, I don't see how you can help him, because it's pretty clear to me that you're the reason that he's in this state right now. He is living inside a nightmare, inside of his mind, because of you, and you're the one who put him there. And I'm guessing that Why you just you came back... you shut your mouth, Rick? Dare question Jason's motives. And who are you to pronounce judgment on anyone? I'm Sonny's brother. You're scum. And you're his ex-wife. Carly, I want him to get better. I can't really make the same claim about you. You know, Sonny's been living with these episodes for years, and neither one of you have done a damn thing We to have protected him. Sonny and helped him through it every time, Protected? Rick. Here's a novel idea. How about something like a diagnosis, a, a treatment, you know, some real help? Instead of Jason managing the situation in his own special way, and you following him around like some pathetic puppy dog. What, when uh, Sonny's at his most vulnerable, Jason swoops in, he can save him. You need a hired assassin, hire Jason. Need a mental health expert, you know, go for Jason, he's your guy. The idea of the two of you protecting Sonny is a joke. And the idea of you lecturing anyone on mental health is beyond a joke, Rick. What's the matter, Carly? Did you get tired of Bed and Jack's you came to play with your ex-husband? Get the hell out. You're not welcome here. You know, what's, you know what's really a crime here? Jason doesn't want Sonny to get better. You don't want to give him back his power. You don't want to give him back his business. You just want to keep things the way they are. Jason is the reason Sonny is alive. Jason should be in the hospital right now, and he's here because Sonny needs him. Or secretly, Jason wants to keep Sonny under his thumb. 
I don't know. Maybe you're the one who wants to manipulate Sonny. You're ready to exploit Sonny's illness. And you know there's no way Sonny would let you in the same room, much less his life, if you weren't crazy. Okay. And you want to keep him that way. Well, why don't we see what Sonny has to say about that? Why don't we not? No, no, Carly. No, you know, I'm sick of this. Carly. I'm sick of this. What are you you don't have the strength Carly. to get him oh, out of here. come on, Carly. Get the hell out. You're talking to me about mental health? What is this? Carly. Get the Carly. hell out of here. Carly, Carly, yeah. hey. Leave him alone. You should know, Rick's been trying to get rid of me and Jason. Rick's trying to help. No, Rick doesn't help anyone but himself, you and have, you know that. You have to understand that you haven't been around lately. Jason hasn't been around. Rick has. He's helped me. He's been great. You must be loving this, and you must be worse off than I thought. Oh, that's great, Carly. Yeah, attack Sonny because he disagrees with you. Way to look out for him. I'm not going to leave you with him. Sonny, you are both doing more harm to Sonny than good. Look, you know Jason will take care of you. Sonny. Tell him. It's up to you. I know you don't like my brother. You don't trust him. I didn't either once, but... When I was going through this... He was here for me. And I can count on him. Thanks for... You know, doing that, I think we got beyond our past, in a way. That's all I've ever wanted, Sonny. And for you to get help. But you gotta understand something, okay? I'm very grateful for what you did. But Jason and Carly, they know how it goes from here on. They know how to get me through this. And it always happens again. But I'm... I'm in control now. I'm feeling much better. My hands aren't shaking. I'm going to be okay. Sonny, I'm not so sure with these two, okay? You need professional help. Carly and Jason do not want to do that. For Can't you. go to the hospital. I'm not saying that. But their way hasn't worked either. Sonny, you have managed to control these episodes for years, and it has wrecked your life. And they just keep getting worse. Look, look, look what happened. You had to send Emily out of the country, for God's sakes. What's going to happen next? Is it really worth all of that? To not get professional help. I mean, don't you want to try something different, a different way? You don't understand, Rick. Sonny, I know that now is not the time for you to shut me out. I am here to help you. I know that, but I just... It's my decision... I'm gonna be okay. This isn't over, Jason. I'm not gonna keep him isolated in six so you can manipulate him. That's how your mind works. You're saving yourself righteous crap, Jason, all right? My brother may forgive you, but I don't. If your brother needs you, he'll call you. Otherwise, don't show your face here again. Turned a corner. Yeah. That's good. How are you? You don't look so good. Um, just don't worry about me. The only reason I came over here was to try and talk you into going back to the hospital. Elizabeth's running around town saying you're going to drop dead if I don't do something about it. And I'm glad I came. Yeah, yeah me too. Look, he's going to be tired for a few days and then he's, he's going to be back to his old self. I, I don't know. This time it feels worse than it's ever been. You know, it's different symptoms he, he's seeing things that don't make any sense i know i know i've never seen him this bad but he's determined to get better i hate rick but that doesn't mean he isn't right about getting help you take care of sonny you always pull him back from the edge but maybe, maybe there's a better way if there's a better way we're gonna find it okay but i can tell you this it's no accident that sonny got this bad when rick was the one holding his hand it's a 
see you tonight. Yeah, it is. Something wrong? No, I'm just... Just thinking. No, you're upset. What, did you get into a fight with Alexis? Yeah, no. No? Okay, then... Who? Look, Sam, I don't really think that we should be talking about this. Otherwise, all this progress we've made into being one big happy family is going to go right into the toilet. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did I do something wrong? No, no, it's just your questionable taste of men, that's all. Okay. Sorry, uh, sorry. No, it, it, that's okay. It's, it's Jason. What did he do? He's a selfish, controlling bastard. You know, it's kind of nice we actually finally agree on something.